speaking, those who don't speak Arabic. <coughs> Uh, being, a, being American it give you an advantage because you don't need a visa to go there they give you the issue visa at the airport if you have an American passport then they give you a visa pay $25 and they give you a visa for one month and once you make it to the camp where Sheikh Raslan is then as long as you stay there you're okay they says you're okay as for the 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 living, like it says, it's a it's a small city village, but there is a, if somebody is interested to make that move, then you have to talk to uh, a person over there because the the the, the institute is run by the Sheikh Raslan's son, Sheikh Abdullah, and few other people who they help him run the whole camp and they. Uh, they run the affairs of the students and families and the like. And from that, if you want to go, you need to get in contact with them prior of going. Whether you be single or a family, so that they can prepare for you the arrangement where you're going to stay. If you're a single, it's easy. They're going to find you one of the uh, homes or apartments where there is a few singles and you just go live with them and share the rent and whatever with them, utilities with them. If you're married with children or not, then you need your own spot and then they will find you an apartment. Alhamdulillah. Like he says, the rent is very cheap. Three bedrooms apartment is like $25, $30 a month. A month. It's hard to believe, right? Allah, man, it's amazing. And it's amazing. Now that's what it is, yes, because of the money exchange. Because one dollar is like almost 18 pounds, their money. So some people are paying 400 pounds. It's like 25 bucks, not even. Some paying 500 pounds, it's like 29 bucks. $27, okay, 28 Okay, so, but the program is very serious program. It's like, this, they have 15 books. And if, if, if every book, it's a level. They consider it as a level. And, and every book, you go like f five weeks. Five weeks in there. So like two years, you will finish that program. If you stay there the whole, the whole time. It's serious, you have to attend five times a day, maybe three hours a day, and then and then four, four, four weeks of studying and one week for reviewing and tests. You pass the test, you go to the second book. And Hakada. Uh, <clears throat> and also you have to have good manners and good etiquettes in there. No fitna makers in there. Somebody go and start some fitna and show some, they, they kick him out. Said, you're here to learn, you're going to learn. And you have respect for the ulama, you're going to bring us that fitna and you know, stuff. Likewise, a person, as long as they are there, they have to attend the classes also. And salawat, unless if they're sick or something, they so. So there is, it's a lot of benefits. Alhamdulillah. If you finish that program, you can speak Arabic already and you know a lot of things, alhamdulillah, in Arabic. And with that, also they have Quran, Tahfid. So you can do like after Fajr, they have different sessions. They have three hours after Fajr and three hours after that before Dhuhr, three hours after that, Hakkad. So you can do like your Arabic in the, in the morning and do Tahfid in the afternoon. Salam, Hakkad. Quran. So you can do both Arabic and Quran. Also memorizing the Mutun. And you can attend the classes of Sheikh Raslan also. Okay? So, you, you if you will, if you have the means, I will advise go and check it first. If you have the means, mashallah, she can go for one week or two weeks, or even a month or a couple of months. Go check it out. Beside the plane ticket, you need a few hundred dollars. If you're going by yourself, alhamdulillah, they will arrange for you to stay with some. Young Tolab over there. 
And it's amazing, you know, that, that, that village, it's amazing now. You got people from America, from Canada, from Sweden, from Europe, Italy, Spain, name it, France, China, Indonesia, Malaysia, Australia, Russia, a lot of Russians. Africa, a lot of Africans. It's amazing. People from all over the place, they're learning over there, mashallah, and their children are learning. Ni'mah, and it's cheap. So, see how, but, but don't just leave like that. You know, like I says, if you have the means, go check it out and see what's going on. Now you have a better idea, inshallah ta'ala, and then you can come and, 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 and prepare for it. Uh, as for those who cannot go, and yes, they have a program. They launched a program on, on, on online. It's Al-Furqan. I'm going to, if you don't mind, Abu Khadija, I'll send you the information, and then you share it with the brothers. Uh, or what, what you do is, there is a number of uh, the, the, the mudir of the markas, his name is Hussam Sha'lan. All you have to do, he speaks a little bit of English. He understands. He cannot hold a, like a solid conversation, but he can. And if you send him a message, he will understand it and reply to you. And there is a number. His number. You once you you store it in your phone. He has a, he has a WhatsApp, and you send him text. Say, "Salam alaikum, Sheikh Hussam. I'm so and so. Abu Muhammad gave me information, and I want to enroll myself, my wife, my daughters, my cousins, my community, whatever you can." Even if you can pay for somebody in the community that can afford it, Allah Akbar, can you imagine if they learn Arabic? Subhanallah, it's amazing. It's amazing if somebody like, let's say you don't have time, but you see somebody struggling, uh, another family, they, they want to put their children, but they can't, and you say, I, I, got it. I got you. One of your children is on me, and the other one is on the other brother. Just, Allah Akbar. Couple years, those brothers they'll know more Quran, more Arabic, and it's all go to your account of good deeds. See, that's just how we see things. Alhamdulillah, this beautiful religion of Islam. And also, they work with you. They like three days. They said, how many days you want to do? He says, okay, three days a week. Ah, one hour or two hours? Yes, two hours good. And then Skype, all you need. Skype. Now they're using Skype, but. Uh, they were they were using Zoom clouds, but they had some issues with it. So, whatever, whatever server, this is called servers. Those are servers, Skype and stuff, or applications, whatever they used. They tell you download it, and you're good to go. And you, they will send you the book PDF, and you can download it. You can print it. You go to one of those depots or whatever, office depot, and make it as a book. Oh, how can I? And you can, alhamdulillah, benefit. They accommodate you according to your, especially we have a seven hours different right now. Alhamdulillah, you can learn in the morning, you can learn only in the weekend, let's say your kids or you, the only time you have is Saturday and Sunday, two hours a day, alhamdulillah. They will say, no problem, what time? From 9 to 11, bismillah. If they have time, then they will work with you then. Okay? And beside the point, uh, I mentioned the 23rd of December, actually, does, okay, I'm not going to be here. Because uh, our brothers in Masjid Sunan Nabawiyah, they have in their seminar. Yeah, I forgot. They have in their uh, seminar, and we're going to be there, inshallah ta'ala, okay, from the 21st to the 25th. Masjid Sunan Nabawiyah, they do one seminar about a very good topic and a book, also Sunnah of Imam Ahmed. And a lot of brothers, they're going to be there, alhamdulillah, Musa, Abul Hassan, and all of them. So, alhamdulillah, if those who can attend that seminar, that'd be good. If you can't, alhamdulillah, try to listen and tune in on Spreaker or something like that. No questions? Zakumullah. Huh? Barakallahu feekum Allah hafadkum. Hayyakum Allah. Alhamdulillah, I didn't get a chance to talk to you since I think before I left for Hajj, but I just want to say Barakallah.